everyone, welcome back to my channel and coming to you from Warsaw. The clips that you saw in the beginning of the video, some of them were actually from yesterday when the weather was slightly different. And then the one prior to this is actually a breakfast I had in my favorite place in, uh, in Old Town. An historical hotel Bristol. I love to go there when I'm in Warsaw to have a breakfast. I'm not staying there, but it's a beautiful, beautiful hotel. Anyway, what I would like to tell you today are several things besides, of course, the sightseeing, showing you clips from Warsaw. Like this spot, for example, right here in the park. Uh, I've mentioned yesterday in my video with Scott Ritter the interview that was given on RMF24 RMF24, I will attach the link below this video and in that interview the commander-in-chief let me show you how beautiful here how beautiful, so peaceful the commander-in-chief uh, of the fire department for Poland, right? announced about this app, application, that soon will be ready for the Polish citizens and they can download it on their phones in case if there is, in case if there is what, right? Emergency, all of a sudden, after 30 years, and they can hide into the shelters. So as you remember, I have posted, I believe, two videos about that inspection that was taking place in Poland. Inspections of the shelters and he is the one, uh, that commander-in-chief, responsible for checking those shelters. Which, by the way, again a reminder, they only provide the safety, the shelter for 3% of Polish population of the country. So in that interview he made a statement that they are in a really bad condition and they need a lot of work. Ah, yes, after 30 years. So that's what's coming. I don't have the article at the front of me, but I pretty much remember what he said. If you want to read this more in detail, you can find the link now below the video. And I will be going from this park. Actually, this is the park where you have the statue of is it here, Frederick Chappell? I think it is. Anyway, I'm going to Łazienki Park, which is my favorite park in Warsaw. Every time I'm in Warsaw, I make sure to go there and spend some time. Even if it's not green, it's okay. It's still more quiet and you can contemplate. If I can go inside the museum and record there, I will try to do it for you. But then once I'm there, I will give you another information that I came across very recently. Okay, let's go to the next step. Okay guys, as you can see I'm in Wazienki Park, love this park, really do. So what I want to tell you now is something that I came across again some time ago because I was traveling, I was not able to, to post it, uh, but I have this written down for you. I'm not sure what portal this was from, we'll have to look again and attach the link below in the video so you can read it. It's about Polish forests. So the, tar the title of the article is Scandal, the EU is taking over Polish forests. Poland is threatened 
by the collapse of the timber industry. On Tuesday, I believe last Tuesday, the European Parliament voted on the changes proposed by the European Parliament regarding the exclusion of forests from national compensions and their transfer to so-called share compensions. One second, let me see. Um, and the Minister of Climate, Anna Moskva, I mentioned her many times, she is responding before our eyes. Poland is losing control over its own forests. We will not allow this, she said. The hundred years of experience of our forests goes to the goes to the trash. No one has any illusions anymore. This is the deprivation of further rights of the member states by the EU institutions, she said. And one more thing, one second, let me flip the pages. It's about, in Poland, about 80% of forests are in the hands of the state, which distinguishes Poland in Europe. So this is another thing about destruction of Polish forests. Not only, as I told you this before, I think half a year ago, I was telling you how they are cutting the trees and selling it to Ikea or whoever is making like cheap furniture and other places. Um, that's what they do. They usually go like into, in the middle of the forest, which is the habitat for many birds and animals. And you don't see it from the outside, from the edges, but inside is like empty forest. Horrible stuff. But this is what I want to tell you. We see how this goes as well. And I will have one more thing about, of course, uh, Polish MiG planes. But this is when I get back to the hotel so I can read to you properly the article. Some of you already know what Poland has done. Meanwhile, I will be putting some clips together from Warsaw. Hopefully you enjoy it. If you do, please leave the thumbs up and see you in the next clip. I have to admit, and this is really <laughs> shameful, I used to live in Warsaw, uh, I was attending art school and I came here so many times to Warsaw and I never went into those palaces here in Wazienki uh, Park. So today I got a ticket, 40 złoty, 40 it's like, what is it, 8 dollars, 9 dollars, and you can um, explore all the palaces here actually three of those three of those so let's start with the first palace Now we will be going inside the second palace, palace on the aisle, which is right here, let me show you. So when you see all those birds over there around, this is the second palace. There are five buildings, I believe, that you can uh, explore. This will be our second one. I think we will do like three buildings today, maybe two.
All right, just left the park on my way to have a coffee, maybe something to eat. Uh, I love the park, but there is one thing that I don't like, which is they don't allow dogs in Wajinki Park, which I think is absolutely ridiculous. Especially when you think about other parks in the world, even like Kensington Park, right, in London. I have no problem, so no dogs allowed. I don't like that part. All right, everyone, here you can see the presidential palace in Warsaw. This is where Buddha resides. And right next to it, you have the hotel I've mentioned before where I had my breakfast. It's a Bristol Hotel. And if you go this way, you go to the old town, which we will be exploring tomorrow and I will be getting um, the news I supposed to do today, but I feel like I will record it tomorrow for you. So I will end this video here. Hope you enjoy some clips from Warsaw. Lots of love, everyone. All the links to follow me you find down below this video. One more place to show you. Right here. Bye, guys.